And speaking of the homeless, a lack of shelter beds is a huge issue across the region, but it's especially bad in North County. Now a nonprofit at Escondido is adding 106 beds in a facility that is, quote, far more than a shelter. KUSI's Ed Lenderman has the story. It's a former motel on Escondido's Center City Parkway that had seen better days. With help from the county and private donations, the nonprofit Interfaith Community Services purchased it, rehabbed it extensively, and in two weeks, the Turk Recuperative Care Center will open with 106 beds. It's the only such standalone center in the county and a prime example of the kind of forward thinking every municipality in the county ought to be considering. Interface CEO Greg Angel live with us on Good Morning San Diego. Hospitals do all that they can to connect people to care, but again, there's no shelters that are often available. And if somebody isn't well enough to move into a shelter, they may often end up back on the streets. And so we see individuals who have hospital uh, bracelets on, who don't have uh, their own clothing, who end up um, uh, having their health conditions worsen. Still, Angel laments the fact that Interfaith is turning people away at its other facilities. Some 2,000 homeless in the North County, only 144 beds. Now, however, a homeless individual in need of continuing physical and or mental health care after a hospital stay will not only have a bed, but hands-on treatment including addiction treatment. Our staffing team includes nurses, mental health clinicians, and social workers to address health conditions and to help people end their homelessness. There's a multi-purpose dining hall that serves as a life skills teaching area. The outdoor pool has been converted into a recreation area. There's even an elevator big enough for a gurney since the exam rooms are upstairs. Again, the only such facility in the county. We don't need any ongoing support from cities or county. We work with hospitals and healthcare partners who will provide the funding for us to take care of people here. Um, and to your point, where else are we looking to expand these locations? Um, we've had conversations with the city of San Diego. Councilmember Joe LaCava has come and visited um, and, um, and healthcare partners from throughout the county. There's clearly a need and an interest to create more um, proven effective facilities like this. And from just about anywhere on the property, you can enjoy the largest mural in this area. Opening day May 1st in Escondido at Lenderman, KUSI News.